You guys, Lex here, back for some more Nino Kuni. Last time, we went to Perdita, fix her heart. Now I'm probably gonna do all the side quests here before talking to her, <laughs> just in case. Also, right after I ended, I did a bunch of gambling and fix my controller, I think. There's a manual fix I had to do. Let's see if it worked. Let me do these hearts first. You come from another land? This is our home. Perdita is small, but we have big hearts. Hermana, I am hungry. I'm sorry, Hermanito. I will prepare dinner now. What do you want to eat? Oh, thank you, Hermana. Can you make a stew again, please, Hermana? Is he our little brother, miss? You two seem to get along real well. We get along very well, it is true, but he's not my real brother. Really? Seeing you act so kind, I was sure you must be family. As you see, our town is very small. We are all like family here. Everyone in this town cares for each other. We look after the young and the old as if they were our own family. Hey, a town where everybody treats each other like family sure sounds nice. Yes, we are truly blessed. I love my home with all my heart. Wow, this girl sure has a lot of love on Mr. Trippy. Um, excuse me, miss. We were wondering if we could ask you a favor. Favor? Please, tell me more. Well, um, we were wondering if you'd be kind enough to share us with some of your love in your heart. Oh, truly, people from far away are very different from us. Tell me, what must I do? Just hold up for sale for a second, it won't take long. Uh-oh. That was a double. <laughs> Let me fix this. I didn't fix it in the main menu. Hopefully that fix it. The thing that makes the world go round. Some love. Is it over now? I'm not sure what you did, but my heart feels light. Hermana, I'm so hungry! I wait tomorrow. <laughs> okay. I'll prepare dinner now, Hermanito. Our mountain town is far from our people, but still we can live here. We pass knowledge and alchemy formula from generation to generation. You know about alchemy, huh? Of course, since we are children, we have watched all Aunt Sianna does. So she taught you, huh? Hey, would you mind sharing some of your formula with us? I would not mind at all. Have fun trying them out. Gee, thanks! New formula. Nice. Let me check that out. Onyx? All be gone. That sounds good. Don't think you could buy those. Echo Stone. Sainted Sword. Split Wing. Ooh, that looks nice. Ninny Hammer. Rainbow Lance. Ice Crystal Claws. Mystical Shield. Ooh, it uses Avenger Shield. Phantom Mantle. Medal of Steadfastness? Nah. Barrier Badge. Bastion Badge. Maybe? Increases defense. Hard Headed Badge. That's it. Let's talk to her. Look, have you seen a uh, sight more beautiful than this evening sun from this mountain of ours? Yeah, hey, you're right. It sure is pretty, ma'am. The thing I Get a load of that. You don't see a view like that every day. Yes, drink it in, for this beauty is all ours to enjoy. From this mountain, we see the sun sink into the sea each evening and bid farewell to the day. We watch each of the colors drain from the world as the night sky dons its scary robes. Its beauty takes my breath away every time. Wow, I bet that's really something. I sure would love to see it. Oh, but you must, you must. Nowhere in this world is a sunset that can match the development of Perdita of that, I am sure. This lady sure got a lot of confidence. Well, if it is any blooming wonder, that's a backdrop and a half, mon. Makes me look all epic and windspent to me. Uh... What are you giving me that look for? You got something to say? Put Spit it out, man. Oh, pardon me, ma'am. I was wondering if you could help, maybe help us out? Well, I'm not sure I'm able to. What is it you want from me? So do you talk about the view? You sound real sure of what you think. I was wondering if you might share some of your confidence with us. You wish to borrow my confidence? Truly, you say strange things, but I am sure... But I see they mean no harm. Please proceed. 
Thank you, babe. Here it goes. Oh, did the double. <laughs> I guess I didn't do it right. The heaven sends strength to believe in oneself. He obtains the confidence. Okay, that should have fixed it. Ay, 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 my heart, it tickles. Oh, look, the sun begins as it said. Please do not miss the beauty about to unfold. Yeah, whatever. Talk to her. We cannot leave everything to Queen Kulan. We must stand up to Shadar. If we don't, we can say this town has truly changed. We must have hope in our hearts. That is the way to defeat Shadar. Thank you all over the hearts of our people are whole again. These two again? What the heck? And dear, don't you think it's time to go? We'll get the business done in an out of way place like this. Doesn't sound like you, darling. We've always managed to make a decent living, no matter where we've gone. It's nice to see you both again. Is everything okay? Ah, it's you. Well, the thing is, my darling wife has suddenly decided that we don't stand a chance of sailing anything here. I don't know. I just don't think I can carry on like this, going uh, from one place to the next, only uh, ever scraping by. I mean, even if we did uh, get our dream shop off the ground, how long will we last? Year? Months? What if the customers stop coming? You know, this sounds a lot like... You got it, Ollie boy. Her confidence is in short supply. So are we going to do something about it, or what? Downhearted wife, one of the traveling merchants is suffering a crisis of confidence, and Perdita is over her husband is at loss. Store confidence, these are anxieties, sure. If traveled far and worked so hard, we can't just let them throw it all away. How many times have they helped the spare now? Anyway, you know the drill of oh, she needs confidence boost in it. Okay. Yep, okay, I fixed it. <laughs> okay. Okay, give her. So there's a there's a delay in the controller or you have to Add a delay from pressing the button down, and add a delay for letting go of the button. <laughs> There's a bug, so I had to manually add that in the settings. Oh, it feels warm and tingly inside. All my worries seem to have melted away. Come on, darling husband, we've got places to be, and more importantly, things to sell. We'll be able to open a tree shop in no time. Good luck with everything. Oh, I almost forgot. Here's something for your trouble. Thank you for always being there for us. The tonic. Downward wife, one of the traveling merchants is suffering a crisis of confidence in Perdita's ever supposed to be a loss. <laughs> yeah, let's go. Uh, okay, that's the cookie lady. Who's this? Believe in blessings will cleanse us. What they would make us forget everything. But what kind of life is that? There are some things that should never be forgotten, no matter how sad, no matter how painful. Oh, this guy. Ay, 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 my boiler back. It aches. Excuse me, sir, are you okay? Ah, oh, do not worry about me, it's just I am old. I have more aches and pains with each passing day. I, 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 it aches, so. Oh. You'd be kind enough to help me, young man. You see, I cannot apply this. Hmm, <clears throat> oh. Something that matters? <laughs> no, I don't want to apply it on you. It seems I have no more of a special compress that I use to ease the pain. Oh, is there nothing else you could use? I'm afraid not. I bought a number of compresses from a peddler some time ago, like, but like you, they do not last. For a special kind of cold compress, handmade by a tomte who resides, resides in Yule. Whenever I place one of my poor back, its icy embrace would swiftly soothe my pain. That one I fear I will shall know no relief. I ask a favor of you, will you travel to Yule for me and collect a cold compress from the tomte there? An old man in Perdita suffering from terrible backache agreed to help the old man, I guess. Grateful to you, but remember that Yule's far from here. Take care, you must not endanger yourself on my account. Thank you, sir. I sure will. It'll be okay. We can just teleport there. You wait here. Talk to this guy. Okay, never mind. I teleported there and back, and there's a whole ton of uh, people. <laughs> so let's uh, do all the stuff here first. Perhaps we bought all this on ourselves. We're not strong enough to resist. Let's talk to this girl. I can I forget that dream? Huh? What's the matter? It was yesterday I had a strange dream. What kind of dream was it? It's like a no dream I've ever had. There's a girl who looked just like me. She had my face, but she lived in another world. 
My dream, the girl is planting flowers. I've never seen her before. Beautiful flowers. Gee, does that's like a stray streep. Listen, I felt something too, though. I did not know how that girl and I, we were joined. It's hard to explain. I reckon she saw in her dream and was from your world, Ollie boy. Our soulmates, most likely. What do you say? This boy really come from the same place the girl in my dream? From another world? That's right, I come from another world completely different from yours. Is it true? That's incredible. Can I ask you something? In case you ever meet that girl I saw? Uh, sure, I guess. What I want is a flower. I would like very much to have one of the flowers that the girl in my dream grew. Meet her, please ask her to for such a flower. The young girl from Perdido wants a flower like those she saw in a dream. A dream about her soulmate in Motorville. Uh, sure. Thank you. Flowers I saw, they were pink and in a pot. I've never seen flowers like that before. Sounds to me like you dust off a certain spell and head back to your world, Ollie boy. I guess we better go find a girl who looks just like her. Uh, let's go. Unless there's a whole bunch of other stuff. Let's see. Motorville's not that big. What's wrong with your car? Howdy, all I'm taking my family to see a double feature at this new drive and let me know if you'd want to join us. <laughs> oh, her. Hey, hey, Mr. Trivia, this girl is. That she is, my lad. Her and that little missy over by Perdita could be twins, man. Soulmates they are, or I'm a donkey's dad. Oh, what do you want? Something else here, the flower you grow. Do you have any pink woods? Yeah, I have pink tulips. They're real pretty. You do? I think you'd love to have some. I would, but they're all dried up. Oh, huh, dried up. Yup, look. Boy, they're kind of shriveled, huh? Mr. Tribute, is there anything we can do? You're the wizard! <laughs> what are you asking me for? <laughs> can I see? You're a flipping wizard, aren't you? <laughs> God. How am I supposed to know if you had a spell that will restore flowers to flower more flipping glory? Of course, I use magic to bring them back. It's just about to bring them back to life, ain't it? Nature stone? No. Quicken growth? Rejuvenate. Look at that, the bloom! They're blooming, blooming! There's a beautiful, nice one, Ollie boy. Give it to me now. You know! The flowers came right back to life! Oh, you're amazing! That was like magic! Like magic, he says, the shape of it. That was magic, love, the real deal. What? Did you not hear something? I thought I heard somebody yelling. Oh, I'm on. She can hear me. How do you? I do, love. Nice weather I've been having at it. Mr. Trippy, not now! Hey, did you just hear a voice down near the ground there? Uh, no. Guess it must have been the wind, anyway. About those flowers, can I maybe have some? Sure, but you have to promise to show me another magic trick next. Trick? They're all tricks, man. They're spells. Spells, you chicken little. Obtain hometown flower. Let me travel back. Oops. Take gate back. I mean, gateway back. <laughs> Where does it put us? At the front? Talk to those two later. Oh, she's over here. Oh, it's so beautiful, just like the flower in my dream. Funny, I don't remember there being flowers like that at Motorville. I guess they never and ever really looked. There's something there coming on flowers. Do you not think? Thank you for bringing me the flower. Please accept this. Two carnation cakes, two wildflower sundaes. Out of this world, the young girl from Perdita wants a flower like she saw in the dream and dream about her soul in Motorville. Okay, how many is that? Check. Uh, let me talk to these two. What kind of future awaited us if you had blindly clung to those blessings? So what Queen Kulad gave us was no blessing. 
it. We did not resist. We merely clung to her. We are to blame, not her. No, you're all to blame. You all suck. Uh. Wait, let me look at the quests. Holy shit, there's so much! <laughs> That's why I got surprised when I went to, uh, Yule. There's so many. An elder elderly Mamuni fruit farmer is said to be thinking of selling Babana farm. What's wrong with a farmer? What's wrong with a young woman in Castaway Cove? Uh, pet. Hamlin. Yule. Traveling merchant. Traveling merchant's back in Ding Dong Dell? Huh. The ghost girl. Looking for someone. Perdita. Yep. An alpaca. Hmm. They're already doing that. Erwin. Lost. Wait a minute. Is that the dude? The journal guy? Oh, lame bounty? No. How about bounty? Okay, we're already doing that. Three. Oh, I need one more. Alright. Gotta find that alpaca. Oh, it's down there. To this girl. But Nino is always so sad, but I pretended not to notice. So oh, I feel so sorry. How can I help you? Oh, yeah. I need to sell all that stuff I grinded out earlier. I'm gonna sell 30, or keep 30. Also, these. I'm gonna keep like 30. Uh, I think that was only. There. Ah, I keep... And what else did I buy? Oh yeah, I bought a bunch of these too, didn't I? Yep. And a bunch of these. Oh wait, wrong one. As long as I don't die, <laughs> uh, that's I should be good. Ah, this is truly gladdening to see the people of Perdita restored to their old selves. These people arbored us when we fled from the ruins of Xanadu, with my queen gravely injured and her heart broken. How did we repay them with blessings that were neither good nor true? That's not your fault, sir. You were just obeying that evil queen. Obedience is no excuse. True. I could I could have done something. There's no point crying over spilled milk, man. That sounds back to normal, so all will end well in it. You're right, of course. And now I will do all I can to protect the people of this town. That's great, sir. In my gratitude, thank you for saving my queen. Chadar rod on Xanadu cannot be undone, but I sense that those who lost their lives are grateful to you. I feel sure the ghostly guard will admit you would agree. Few artifacts from Xanadu now remain, but I have held on to this. Here, take it. It's yours. Ooh, formula. How can we ever thank you enough? You have freed Queen Kulan from Shadar's bonds. What Shadar wrought upon Xanadu cannot be undone, but I feel my brothers and sisters can rest a little easier. Cool. Good thing I read. Talk to everyone. What did he give us? Uh... Okay, Harold's harp. Oh, okay. Need that for uh, Esther. <laughs> yeah, we need that. I met Queen Kulon when she ruled over Xanadu, a kingdom built on a floating island in the sky. By chance, my crew and I were away on a voyage when Shadar struck. When we returned, no trace of Xanadu remained. I think I would find my queen again here in the back of beyond. <laughs> It's enough to make my heart grip leave in miracles. But 
terrible spice of her food has run dry. And let's, uh... There is no world milk pack, all that boy. Majestic in it. They always had them in pretty to the half. Orku, orku, orku. So she's trying to sell me something. You're not wrong, Harry. Fellow, something to say, and no mistake. That first spot of magic, I reckon. Hey, oh gosh, shoot. Nature star. Hello, I want you to do something for me. I'm simply starving. Can't you hear my tummy rumbling? Might have you some tasty morsels all for a hungry alpaca. Ah, uh, say what food, huh? I'm sorry, Miss Nopper, what do you want to eat? My kind of fed hay morning, noon, and night, but I have grown tired of frankly one-dimensional taste and uninviting texture. Is the merest hint of luxury too much to ask? A little gourmet treat, perhaps? Gourmet treat, huh? Precisely, would it be wrong for a humble alpaca to sample the lights of a juicy babana from Alma Moon? <laughs> How the heck you heard about babanas? We'll living never know. Um, there's a merchant who wants to come here amongst his wares were fresh babanas. Ever since I first set eyes upon them, they have captivated me. Simply must try one. Might you be willing to provide one? Bring me a babana and I'm sure I could exchange something similarly desirable nor offer you in exchange. A little pack and Perdita logs to taste something more refined than its customary diet of hey hey and more hay. Read to help the food of Cecil Paca. Yes. Alright, sure, just right here. Thank you, my tummy's rumbling with anticipation. And... This is delicious. So sweet and... <laughs> fruity. Makes a uh, change of from hay, I can tell you. Look at him gobble it down. In Baban heaven he is. Oh, hey, he sure does seem to enjoy it. Um, num. Oh, that was delicious, but having experienced such a gastronom gastronomic level, it is so clear to me just what I've been missing. I must taste further delights. No hungry. Is it greedy, great hairy lump? Let me see. What do I want to eat for next door? Why do, of course, a glow shrimp. Hold on, Furface. How did a f alpaca in the middle of flipping mountains come to hear about a rare and exotic type of seafood, then, eh? Merchants who come to Marina often speak of strange and wonderful foods. They don't think I can understand why I'm listening. This hurry blinder's got an answer for everything. Well, I guess we can bring you a glow shrimp. Excellent, I shall wait here for a said exquisite morsel. Eh, I actually skipped the first part. I say, it's a glow shrimp. How delightful. I can't wait to taste it. Um, no, 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 no. This, um, 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 is a closer. Never tasted anything like this. It's tender and succulent. It leaves a delightful tag on my tongue. So this is what people make of us about sisu food. Listen to the way the hairball. Oh, my God. <laughs> sure seems a lot about food. Um, no, no, no. That was a real treat. Now, on to the next course. No. Next course? This ain't some fancy flipping restaurant. You tricky so-and-so. Um, are you sure eating all this unusual food won't give you a stomachache? I think you were concerned, but I'll be fine. Now, next course. I would like to sample a black triple from Hamlet. You what? You know how much those living things cost? Hmm. Oh, cost? Hmm. I find the subject distasteful. It is all that matters to me, but if you think money's more important than a hungry alpaca's humble dream? Well, I guess we could be a black truffle. Oh, the smell. Musk, nuts, dung. Must be a black truffle. Oh, I'm going to enjoy this, I assure you. Um, nom nom nom. This is. Oh, oh, or oh, nom ordinary. Uh, go. What the heck? I never thought I'd live to see an alpaca court show yourself a black truffle. There could be no mistake. The black truffle is indeed, indeed the king of foods. It's richly fragrant and boasts the flavor of incomparable death. Faced for true connoisseur. Jeepers, he sure does know his food and some real fancy words too. The texture was nothing special. That being the case, the next delicacy I would like to try is a legendary crutchy snow radish of yule. Bah, got the bit between his teeth now, hasn't he? How long is this greedy fur bag going to keep eating? Uh, he seems pretty hungry. I can't wait for the next course. My tummy's rumbling in anticipation. Oh, he brought me a snow radish. Then, without further ado, I'm going to tuck in. Oh, no, 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 no. Ah, that crispy, crunchy texture. It's just so moorish. And snow radishes are good for you, too. That delightful iciness tends to tingle down my spine. How'd you like it? I do declare that I have eaten enough. My belly's fit to burst. 
Thank you for indulging my whims and taking this humble alpaca on a whirlwind culinary world tour around the world. For you deserve those deliver those delicate morsels. I tasted only hay and a shoe out of curiosity. Rest assured I shan't forget the flavors you have kindly introduced to me too. No, I promise that I would reward you, so I shall. Here you go. Ish Janin. Two and five hundred guilders. Real alpaca. Uh, alpaca in Perdido longs to taste something more refined than its customary diet of hay, hay, and more hay. <gasps> Come on. Be a bonus. No. <laughs> oh, and there's more. I have a fine formula for you to use in alchemical experiments. Use it to make something tasty and feel free to drop and share it at any, any time. Got some blinking cheek. Does he think of nothing but his stomach or what? Yeah, new formula. Can make cheeseburgers. Okay. Princess chocolate. Ooh. Fantastic flan. I can make these. I I need to make these actually. Hot cake. Knicker Bocker Glory. Golden pie. Fruity fruity ice cream. Wait a minute. Why is it only one? Oh sour grapes. Yeah, I don't have a bunch of those. So I need to, while I'm here, I'm going to make a whole bunch of foods, like the one level up made out of stuff I could buy. Let's make milk chocolate, one milk chocolate, Just creamy milk. Oh, it's ingredients. That's yogurt. Oh, here. Wait, I only have one? What? I thought I had more. Okay. Can't make that. Can't make that. How about flan? Yeah, flan. Dumpty egg. And bumbler honey. Mix. <laughs> Huh. Oh, two dumpty eggs. Ah, oh, shit. Plum. Two eggs and one blum. Or bloody blum. Bumbler, honey. Me fly. Now, can I. What? Oh, that's gonna be a pain. I have to do them manually? Oh, jeez. Okay, if I do this, I'll, I'll do it once. So you know what I'm doing, but, uh... Next is carrot cake. So, one cake. Where's the cake? Here's the cake and carrots and yeah, that's it. <laughs> Carrot cake. I think I already showed that. And sour Sunday, which is one Sunday and three yogurts. I gotta figure out where to get that creamy milk. Sour sundae and then salted ice cream would be... One ice cream. Oh wait. Booster shoots. Oh wait, these booster shoots? I'll, I'll make one, but they're not buyable. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay, that's annoying. A sweetie pie, which is... Pie. 
and three carrots. Oh, pop, pop, fizz, fizz. Awarded for alchemizing ten different items. Place the sweetie pie. Right, so those are the, those three things I just made. Plus the milk chocolate, if I ever find a store that gives the milk. Uh, are the ones basic, uh, are the foods that I can make out of basic ingredients. So I'll make those to feed these guys. Here, I'll just give him a snowdrop bonbon. He's not even giving him many hearts. I should really raise his defense, since he's gonna be my tank. <laughs> uh, ice cream. Or... Magical attack? Yeah. Okay. Oh, he could learn more tricks. Damn. Actually, no. He should just have attack. He doesn't need defense. I was thinking of the other one. Luffy, let's give him... Uh, yeah, I'll just give him regular chocolates, but... Wait, no, let me give him pie. For ac accuracy? Where is it? Pie. Okay, I'll just give him regular pies. So I'll do that later. You need magic defense. Or defense and magic defense. I'll give him the frosty flan. Give him all the attack increases and accuracy increases later. You, you know, I've, I've been ignoring Percy because I thought I was gonna release him, but I might keep him, so I'll give him stuff later. Gunther, I'll probably switch out. And Spooky. He's, uh. Yeah, I might keep him. Let's see. I'll give him attack stuff, so I'll fast forward. You know what? I'm gonna switch him out already. Uh, let's see, switch with Gunther. There. Because I always use magic with myself now. I'll switch him. Yeah. Some tricks and tricks. I've got healing rain, water bomb, and. Let me do purifying pulse. Anyone else have extra attack slots? You, Luffy. Human Spy, Deck Blast. Oh, dark damage? Yeah, I'll do that. Anyone level 40? Okay, Mikey's gonna be level 40 soon. Alright, I'm gonna feed everyone the stuff and then I'll cut it out. But, unless they level up. Okay. Luffy. Mm. 
level up, level up. Let's go. Come on. Okay, attack up. Okay, another attack up. Percy. Attack up. Attack up. Attack up. Attack up. Asian up. Attack up. Uh, Alright, just finished doing that. Let me buy some ingredients if I still have some left. Use ten Phoenix Downs. I didn't buy one of these shields. Oh, I used a shield for something. Or someone else. No. Alright, let's go to... Yule. There's gotta be one quest I could do here. And then I could get the catching uh, ability. Welcome to Yule. Oh, so sweet and fluffy, so fluffy fluffy. You're making me blush, yes. So fluffy fluffy, almost too fluffy fluffy, woofy fluffy, so you think he also yes? Oh yeah, he's really cute. Yes, yes, yes. I love my fluffy fluffy fluffy. Being no other for me. Jeepers, look at that locket. I guess she really does have a lot of love for her friend, huh? Looks like it, eh? Hey, would you let us have a little of your love to feel your fluffy friend? Yes, 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 I'm worrying that I love him too much. Please, you must take some. Thanks, just hold still for a moment. Hang on, Ollie boy, you already got enough in your lock. Aw, oh, shit. Get hog it all to yourself. Go share a bit of that now with someone who needs it first. There, good lad. Okay. But him. He looks mad. Ugh, oh, you're being so bothersome. I must work. I have no time to worry about it, so... What is happening to you, husband? You're being so coldly. Something the matter, ma'am. Beautiful boy child. <laughs> It's having a fever, so I'm thinking to go to the doctor. But my husband is saying this is no fever at all, and to not be bothering people. Yes, yes, wife. I'm doubting that this little boy will be caring much for your vexations. Go to home with you now. Oh, is this ever happening? Bit, bit happy to the man who once cared for his family, so... Hmm, <laughs> you are so tiring. Mr. Tribulus, changes all of a sudden. That could only mean one thing, huh? That's right, Ollie boy. Broken heartedness. There isn't a single drop of love in that is heart of his, not a one. Cold as ice, a old man suddenly finds himself unable to care about his family even though his child is ill or restores love. Emily's most important thing there is. Mr. Trippy, we have to help him. And that though, let's give him back the love he lost, shall we? Come on, let's go find some. Here you go. Hmm, what am I? Husband, are you doing better? Yes, I am not knowing what happened to me. Forgive me, wife. Wait, we must be taking our beautiful boy child towards the doctor with haste. Looks like he's cured, huh? Thank goodness for that. That he is. Couldn't let a family in the pa need to pass us by now, could we? Thank you, extremely. This is being only a trifle, but may show you some of my things. Uh-oh. Humanitarian of the Year, awarded for running 60 different errands. Wow. You're in following words, three handful of snowdrop bonbons. Cold as ice. A you old man suddenly finds himself unable to care about his family even though his child is ill. 
Yay. I guess double. Now let's take this heart. Oh, my fluffy fluffy. Here you Let me take it. A cart. Things makes the world go round. There's love. Ooh, this is feeling very strange. For what will you use my my love? I'm going to use it to help people who don't have enough love for themselves. Truly, will this will become lovers of my fluffy, fluffy, fluffy? Yeah, I don't know. Uh, I mean, I'm sure they will. Wow, lying. Let's go get our catch right thing. Is this a guy? If you're in trouble, please just be asking for help. Back of a piece, so Spotter, your safe return, you know. Hmm. Wait, what am I doing? <laughs> Should be here. Uh, lame words. Uh, proves your chance of befriending creatures and making them your familiars. Hell yeah. That's the most important one. Hmm. Yeah, okay. I need to get this jack-o'-lantern to next. Alright, and this guy... Professor Tabitha is writing with her next paper, yes? It's being an analysis of your adventures, Oliver. Oh shit, I haven't talked to Father Oak in a long time. I better remember to do that after this. Evening to you. Does he have ingredients that I don't have much of? gone what's the matter it's my boy child yes he has suddenly disappeared jeez that's awful yes it is yes one moment he is playing with small people and then you will help me seek him yes you'll have to search <laughs> i tell my mother and you was worried about her son whose whereabouts are unknown agree to find the tomte son pretty thank you he was playing with the small people yes you should probably give the lilies around town the grilling then, I. Eh? You're right, let's ask all the children if they've seen them. Please very much. Ooh, can I talk him? Hmm, you were wishing to speak to me, boy? Yes, sir. I have something to ask you. Could you... Could we have one of your cold compresses? Ah, cold compress? You are knowing very well about me, yes. Whereupon your person is hurting, please. Oh, uh, no, it's not me. Someone in Perdita. His back is really hurting. Oh, I am knowing him well. We are communicating through the peddler, yes. So will you let us have a compress? Yes, of course, yes, but I am taking a little time to be making them. That's no problem, sir. We'll just wait right here. Perhaps you'll be listening to my request in return, yes. Sure, what is it? Mangler fishes have been causing much trouble around the region of Yule, yes? Will you please be defeating five of them for me, please, very much? Five, huh? Sure we can. They are fearing fire, yes. To defeat them with the blazing blade the peddler is selling will make them not come back soon. Oh, shit. Uh. Give them all. This is gonna be uh, first priority using a blazing blade for this. Then, uh, oh, there he is. Well, well, fancy meeting you here, old stick. Jolly chilly round these parts, what? You again? You're like proverbial bad buddy you are. What do you get up here? 
Oh, come down, dear boy. There's no need to take that tone. One simply enjoys a spot of old regrination is all regrination. <laughs> and once one's diary has been published, the whole world will know just what's so bally marvelous about roaming the land. Diary, keep losing every five minutes, you mean? Oh, come now, let's see. Leaving dogs lie, shall we? I've tried to learn my lesson. Why, look, it's just, um... It's, uh, let's see, uh, no, uh, oh, bother. What's the matter? Do you really freaking need death, let me ask? I really am dreadfully sorry. I rather seem to have misplaced it yet again. Of course you're flipping it Learn your lesson indeed. Well, shall we come to the aid of flipping party once more, Ali boy? Notes from the snow. A man reeling his mules rather flustered after misplacing his diary for the umpteenth time. Free to look for the missing diary. Where did you lose it this time, sir? We'll see. One had a... One rather had a breath taken away by the cold when we landed here. In fact, one was knocked sparked out by it. You are jeepers. I'm glad you're okay. Rather what? At the dash this stroke of luck, in fact. Some forest folk came across one's prostrate form. When I came to, I was propped against a noggin of moss in the sparkling sylvan glade, somewhere west of here, seems to recall. Or right, I'm just gonna take a screenshot. Perhaps the old diary still there could have fallen out of my pocket, what? Horse glade west of you, huh? We're on it. Okay, let me ask these kids. Okay. No. Nope. Oh, it's this kid. Excuse me, but there's a little top there boy missing. You wouldn't know anything about that, would you? Eek! Eek, you say? Well, I think we all know what that means. Come on, lads, put it out. I have nothing to spit. It was not me. He's having got himself. Why don't you come down a little and explain? We are having a bit together too, but no amounts of glittering I don't to try out bravery. We are being told not to go there because of the wild creatures in danger. Oh, you think your moms and dads tell you that for their own good, is it? If they say it's dangerous, it's because it's proper deadly. I'm sorry to you. What happened to your friend? The voice of the beast came from within the cave and I ran home with fear. But he, he ain't gone inside. He would not talk. He just got lost inside, huh? Well, we can't have that, can we? Well, best go and rescue the poor dad before he gets eaten. Oh, jeez. Alright, let's go... Wait, oh shoot, I forgot what... Um... Manglerfish. What the hell is the manglerfish? Uh, there's a cave west of here? In the forest? Is it here? We need to fight a- Oh, there's a bank! <laughs> okay. Let's go. I need to do all this anyway. Here goes. Oh, see? The controller's fixed. Wait. Wait, I need to attack. So we can get through it without that. Let's do it! Swing! Now you're for it! What wait, was that a double? <laughs> uh, I don't know if I double click. But yeah, I double click. That was a good problem. Yes, I needed that.
Okay, uh, ten green. No such forest. Maybe it's here. The treasure here. Okay. China has a double but not as bad as before. I might need to raise the number a bit. Unless I got the moon drop that I was trying to steal. Where the heck is that thing? Wait, that's south. This would be here. somewhere South. There's only two chests left. Oh, that's cool. And moss? I don't see any moss. No, I'd rather fight this one.
Out here. Alright. Magic. Spring lock. Ooh, nice. Esperilla Sunday. Is there any treasure chests here? Or green ones, I mean. Oh, there is a green one. Is it there? From here? Roly poly jam. East is Tomty Village. Tomty very, very kind. Very warm. Uh, very warm. Heart very warm. Very warm. Also very, very hairy. Visitor again, welcome, welcome. Uh, again, you mean you've had other visitors apart from us? Man, come, black clothes, fall down here, I help. Black clothes, eh? I don't suppose the daft old beggar dropped something, did he? Drop this, he dropped. Gee, it's that the lid's diary. You take, please give him. Yay. Thank you very much. Let me have one. It's a good job our mate he by here picked it up. We'd never have found it in all this snow. Right, time to head back. Oh yeah, that would have been a pain in the ass. Great. Just gonna go see if I could find the flower dudes. I'm not chart chest anymore. Or Oh. Okay. One south. drop stone right I think I got all the chests in the winter wonderlands Flower dude here? No, that was a Yeti. And none? Whatever. Let's just go in, turn everything in. Uh, I didn't need that. Did it, sir? Oh, you are we having defeated them, yes. And my cold compress is being finished. Here, to you. Please be greeting my friend in Perdita. Thank you. Cold compress. Uh, sorry to keep you waiting, sir. We found your diary again. Dear boy, you are an absolute and most possibly the finest of fellows this side of St. Perry, in the hallowed country of Brickshire. You have to take better care of your diary, sir. It has all of the memories of your journey inside it. 
not to mention being one of one's magnum opus. But yes, I really should take better care of it. Oh, do forgive my atrocious manners for you old thing. Suit of dress armor. Damn, looks cool. Boots from the snow, a man and visiting Newell is rather flustered after misplacing his diary for the umpteenth time. Yeah. I'm gonna travel to the cave called Glittering Grotto. Forgot to do, get the kid from there. All the way up there. And up. Left and right. Hopefully they don't attack. Oh. Come on. Here goes. Metamorphos, uh, Mikey. Fire gem, or is it? Yeah, a bunch of jumbo star drops. I want to give him, make, make him a dynamite. Fire one. Flash and burn, whirly gig. Hard stuff. It's almost not full. One, ignore. Oh no. He looks like he's in trouble. Nickers, get a load of that, Ollie boy. That poor dab of a tumpte is in proper sport of a bother. You're right, we gotta help him. Time to send that beastie packing, all said Ollie boy. Drive the monster away. Yeah. That's a spirit, let's give him a proper battery. Your chances, do you? See if, uh, now you're for it. Swing can steal from them. I forgot to heal. Uh oh. Uh, probably should have healed. I should have done all out defense <laughs> really. Wait, no, let me cloud burst these guys.
I still have some double uh, presses, but a lot better. Here goes nothing. Cloud burst again. As long as I keep attacking me.
Oops, that's not what I meant. a lot more trouble <laughs> than I was expecting. Yeah. Ah, that is being very frightening. Jeepers, that was close. I'm sure glad you're okay and everything. But you really shouldn't have come here on your own. Too flipping right. Didn't your mother tell you not to go wandering around the place? I am being very, very sorry. Please forgive me. Well, you're safe now. That's the main thing. Let's head back to you and everybody's real worried about you. Okay, cool. I'll never be making my mother worry once more. Hey, thank you. You brought my boy child home in safety, yes? Ah, I cannot be grateful enough. Pretty, pretty, pretty thank you. We're just glad he's safe, ma'am. Yeah, and at least know now he knows how to listen when his ma'am tells him not to do something, in it, Lily? Yes, I will listen. Yes, sorry to you, mother. You must not be making me worried again, yes? Oh, I'm forgetting. It is nothing, but I must be rewarding you, yes? Medal of Valor. What does that do? You'll have to search. A talented mother in Yule is worried about her son whose whereabouts are not known. Let me check, take a look at that. Uh, Ling Flame. Draw, look at what this does. Familiar Stamina. Importance of Bravery. Eh. What the? Plus nine nine. Oh damn! I do like just sticking to the same one. Wait, there's another movement speed one. I'm taking that. go soon, but I think I could add do a few more things. Me. Flower guy. Oh, there. Okay. We fight one of those flower guys. Two of those flower guys. your chances, do you? Here goes. So strong at level 5.
and shine. Okay, wake someone up. Rid of the shitty thunder spark. Yeah, I gotta switch that out before I forget. Uh, spark. With short circuit. I'll talk to Father Oak and I gotta go. Here we go. Here go. the wrong fight one of these real quick <laughs> for a chance of a gust bloom. on the harp. Earl's harp. And give that to... Esther. A lot better. Alright, let's go to... Dark wood. Hello, old Father Oak. Oh, 
Ho, oh, hello again, young man. It's good to see you. How goes your adventure, hmm? Tell me about it. Oh, so you found all three stones. Sure did. We visited the Vault of Tears, the Winter Isles, we even chased down a ghost pirate's ship. Oh, 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 an adventure indeed. And there's plenty more where that came from, Ollie boy. You'll be sick to the teeth of adventures by this time this is over, you mark my words. What do you mean, Mr. Chippy? I never get tired of having adventures. Oh, 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 you have come far. To think, this is the same boy who came to me without so much as a familiar to his name not so long ago. And you must go still further. Let me give you something to help you along the way. Bottle of Nostrum. What's that do? When evil stands in your path, do not hesitate. Let the magic you have learned help you overcome it. Sure will, old Father Oak. Thank you very much. Cool. Let's take a look at that item. Fully restores MP. Nice. Alright, guys. I uh, think I'm going to end the episode here. And then next time, we'll continue with the story and probably do some more side quests. I don't know. Anyway, thanks for watching. See ya. Bye.